On this video, we are now on our last section, the execution. The first subsection of this part is condition of surfaces. This area requires inspection of surfaces that will receive the materials such as for painting. Second, the preparation. This is where you indicate the treatment of formwork. For example, if you're going to apply paint on a wooden wall, then you'd have to know first the treatments needed by the material that will receive the paint. Third, installation, application, or workmanship. This is the part where you will describe how the material or certain product will be installed or applied. Fourth, field quality control. This is where concrete slump tests or soil compaction tests are indicated. Fifth, patching. This is where you state how the material or product will be repaired. And sixth, cleaning. This is where you will be describing how the material or product will be cleaned and maintained. This is highly recommended to have it on your paper to enable the contractors to properly explain it to the janitorial services. So once again, let me present to you my paper. Under my execution section, I place the condition of surfaces, measurements only if this is necessary for your chosen material, installation, adjusting, and cleaning. In my condition of surfaces, I just typically indicated the initial action you need to do first before installing or applying the material. Next is the measurement. In my case, since the material assigned to me is doors, this part is considered necessary. Here, you shall indicate how the installer or the contractor measured the space provided for the material to be installed. Then followed by the subsection installation. This will be the area wherein you will be describing how the material will be installed. And lastly, adjustment and cleaning. This is the easiest part since all you have to do is state how the material will be adjusted. For example, in my case, if the UPVC door is too tight, then you would have to add lubrication. If it's too loose, then you'll have to tight fit it. Well, for the cleaning part, all you have to do is describe how the material will be cleaned and maintained to last longer. That's all for the documentation of technical specification. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you!